game system operational. Four bounty hunters from the west. Steve. Billy. Bob. And Cormero. Sunset Riders You go collecting bounty on wanted bandits when you get informed that Sir Richard Rosa is the real threat. But before getting to Richard Rosa you'll need to get by his three allies El Greco, Chief Scalpum and Paco Loco. There will be rewards for the bosses ranging from $10,000 to $100,000 for De La Rosa. Steve and Billy are both armed with pistols, while Bob has a rifle and Cormero a shotgun. The pistols are faster, but with the rifle and the shotgun you don't need to be as precise as the pistols. You can shoot in all directions, and you will need to because enemies will be coming at you from everywhere. You also need to jump often to get over obstacles, which is quite useful. Watch out for those doors because they hide some nice power-ups as well, like faster shooting, blow pistol and rifles. You can't pick up any other sort of weapons besides the dynamite if timed well and later on some gatling gun. Still there's plenty of ways to take you and your enemies out like boulders, barrels, logs and fire. The arcade version of the game was released in 91. Still, the SNES version is the most faithful, besides the native Americans are gone. Also, none of the characters actually take a drink. And you don't fight women, they were replaced by a red cowboy. Even the ones that give you bonuses, they have longer dresses now. The game will take you across a lot of levels, each varied and different in some way than the previous one. There's two levels with some horseback riding. They're very well done and they actually change the pace of the game. After some of the levels, you'll be getting a bonus level. The objective is to get as much cobbles as you can. The boss fights are great. Compared to other arcade games, you don't feel like you're fighting the clone of a previous boss. Each bosses have different sentences before and after the fight. They add some humor and personality to the bosses. With the famous Murray me with my money. Those terrible men. My personal favorite fight is the one against the twin brothers in the saloon. There is not really something special about it, it's just that it feels unexpected the first time you experience it. Dodging those bombs and lanterns, and finally you get the best reward ever. The nice show. And now to the last boss, Senior Rosa. He's a bastard, and when you think you actually get him, you're like, what the fuck? Surprise, he was wearing some sort of bulletproof metal sheet. Then it's on, fair and square. And once he's dead, the reward is all yours to collect. I said 
today. Bit of bad luck. Arcade Trick! <laughs>